Come to Jesus now, he'll save you now. Yay! Come to Jesus now, he'll save you now. Whoa! Come to Jesus, come to Jesus, come to Jesus now. Hello, lovely viewers. This is Just Been Greatness. Welcome to my YouTube channel. On this channel, I share gospel messages, my music videos, my lifestyle. I also do health education and business talks. This morning, I believe that God has something great for you. So watch the video to the end. To my return subscribers, thank you so much for always coming back to watch my videos. If today is your first time coming onto this channel, please subscribe. Don't forget to hit on the subscription button because this channel has so much for you. And don't forget to hit on the notification bell so that you don't miss any of my videos. God bless you so much. Watch the video to the end. We are going to go through is the natural man and sin. The natural man or man and sin. Hallelujah. So, what is a natural man? In sin, hallelujah. It says everyone is born in sin. Everyone is born in sin. Because sin came to everyone through the first man, Adam. That's according to Romans chapter 5 verse 12. You can put down the scriptures. We may not be able to read all the scriptures, so you put down the scriptures. Romans chapter 5 verse 12 and then Psalm 51 verse 5. Psalm 51 verse 5 says that... Hallelujah. Okay, so Psalm 51 verse 5. David said, Behold, I was shaping in iniquity, and in sin did my mother conceive me. So everyone was born in sin. Even the child, the baby that is in, is in the mother's womb is born or is formed. As King David said, he said, I was shaping or shaped in sin. From my mother's womb, I was conceived in sin. So everyone is born in sin in sin because sin came to everyone through the first man adam this original sin nature is what causes men to commit actual sin so actually you don't you you, you are uh, you are not a sinner because you sin but you sin because you are a sinner hallelujah so because you have the natural sin the original natural sin in you which even in your mother's womb you were shaping in. As King David said, in sin was I conceived. So just as a fetus or a baby in the mother's womb is already with sin, which is termed as the original sin, that is the reason why you sin. So by the time a child grows up, the child begins to, you know, do sinful acts like insult, stubbornness and all that. That child is not sinning because He's a, a um, that child is not a sinner because he sins, but it is because the sinful nature is already in that child through Adam. So what is sin? Sin is disobedience to the will of God. Sin is simply disobedience to the word of God or the will of God. Whatever the word of God says, if you go contrary to it, then it is sin. Hallelujah. And Romans chapter 3 verse 23 says, For all have sinned and fall short. Of the glory of God. So today the topic that we are going through is the natural man in sin. Hallelujah. So we will end it here and today we've, we've known what sin is. We've seen that sin is disobedience to the word of God. We've seen that sin is disobedience to the will of God. And then we've seen that everyone is born in sin because sin came into the world through the one man or the first man, Adam. According to Romans chapter 5 verse 12, we say that as um, sin came into the world through the one man adam death also followed that sin and so all have sinned according to romans chapter 3 verse 23 for all have sinned and fallen short of the glory of god so today we have seen the origin of sin the reason why we sin we sin because there is an original nature that man is made with and that is why we sin hallelujah so we will end it here and we will continue next week god willing Hallelujah. And a happy new year to you all. I pray that the Lord will protect you this year. He would, every word that he has spoken concerning you will be fulfilled in this year. And this year you will laugh and you will praise the name of the Lord for his goodness towards you. 
hallelujah this is just from greatness bringing you the gospel kindly share it with a friend or a neighbor amen <laughs>